Charlotte might be known as a banking city, but the Queen City also home to one of the largest urban research universities in the state, UNCC. NBC Charlotte's Ashley Daly was given a behind the scenes look at a few of those laboratories and takes us inside. Ashley. Well, the research being done here has a direct impact on the greater Charlotte community. Students and researchers have made innovations in everything from NASCAR technology to helping surgeons with Ortho Carolina. Today, NBC Charlotte given rare access on a tour behind the scenes of a few of UNC Charlotte's research labs. The tour led by Chancellor Phil Dubois. This campus needed to be a full research university. Now we have a long way to go. This past year, the university breaking records, taking in more than $50 million in research funding through over 400 research grants. Grants that fund research like this in biomechanics and mobility. The patient you see here about to undergo a double knee replacement. Together, students and researchers studying implant designs, giving their findings to surgeons with Ortho Carolina. We answer a lot of questions for them. Most is clinical questions, like uh, these are for the implants for the doctors so different surgical techniques. A few yards away, mechanical engineering students fast at work in the motorsports research lab. Students working on battery research for Land Rover and tire research for Michelin. But the lab also extends to research in nuclear power. Better prepare for the disasters. A research university in Charlotte's backyard, advancing technology and inspiring Charlotte's next generation of workers. Anywhere from working in a company as a manufacturing engineer to being a race engineer, here, you know, I have plenty of opportunity outside of school. Thanks in part to these programs, the university says they've seen enrollment spike now near 30,000, which they say has led them to spend about a billion dollars in construction costs over the last 10 years. Reporting at UNC Charlotte, Asha Daly, NBC Charlotte.